Six, we're hearing from a former U of A professor who is conducting a medical marijuana study and claims she was unfairly terminated from the university. ABC 15's Allison Rodriguez just spoke with her. She joins us now live. And Allison, why does she think she was let go? Well, Stephanie, Dr. Sue Sisley says she was fired for political reasons. She says she was on the cusp of real results in the research of treating PTSD in vets with medical marijuana. But all that seems lost now since she was fired. Dr. Sue Sisley says she's a fighter. I'm going to persevere until this study can be implemented somewhere in Arizona. But the sting of being fired from her employer and alma mater, the University of Arizona, still lingers. Incredibly hurtful because I've been stripped of all of my work without being given any reason why. Dr. Sisley was about to start an FDA-approved study on the effects of medical marijuana in treating PTSD in veterans at the school, a study she says is imperative to helping our service members. And if we don't get this study done immediately, there are going to be vets who are going to be embarking on getting marijuana cards and not having any concept of how to utilize marijuana. This vet agrees. Works for them better than uh, pharmaceuticals. And uh, quite frankly, it works better than alcohol. Dr. Sisley says Arizona legislators who opposed medical marijuana were upset that voters approved the use of the drug for medicinal purposes. She says they took it out on her and the school. It's very clear from the way that the university budgets panned out that U of A got the short end of the stick. She's had offers from universities all across the country to house the study and says she'll keep pushing until it's done. Her goal is to find the best home possible for this work because our veterans deserve the best environment to be able to function in. Now, we did reach out to the U of A, and they say they do not comment on personnel issues, but did say they never felt any political pressure to fire an employee. Meanwhile, she said she is looking into legal options. Yeah, keep us posted as this story develops. Allison, thanks. Next time you're